a bumper crop of opium poppies as far as the eye can see. It's harvest time. Afzal Muhammad has come from Kandahar province to Uruzgan to work the fields and earn a windfall of around $200 in less than 20 days. This is the only time for me to earn money. People work here for about 15 days and then they are jobless for the rest of the year. In Tarinkut, the capital of the southern Afghan province of Uruzgan, poppy farms are everywhere. And the hardy nature of the plant means it's an attractive option. Since there isn't enough water in the province, farmers are unable to grow anything else to earn money. The poppy harvest season is a time of celebration. After working hard all day, farm laborers come together in the evening for games and revelry. This is the best part of the harvest season. This is the time when laborers have fun and enjoy their stay. Despite the international community's multi-million dollar eradication drive, Afghanistan still produces 85 to 90 percent of the world's opium, the raw material for heroin. Currently, we're in a state of war, and if we force people to destroy poppy farms, they will start supporting the Taliban. We are negotiating with the central government to find alternatives before the next season. Afzal Muhammad has done this for more than 35 years and has no qualms about the devastating effects heroin abuse has on people around the world. For him, it's the only way to make a living.